Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Since you guys loved my last IKEA hack video, I thought it would be such a fun idea to walk through some of my favorite products that IKEA has. They have some great new arrivals for spring, but also some other great products that are totally my style and I would love to have in my home or I already do. So I'm going to show you as I walk through their website and I'm going to put myself up in the corner so you can still see me, but you will see a better view of all of the products that I'm looking at today. So I've just pulled up my little document with all of my IKEA favorites. All of this will be linked in the description box as well as in a blog post. So if you saw something you liked, that is exactly where you can find it. I'm going to start off with the new arrivals. I'm not 100% positive that these are all 100% new arrivals, but they are new to me and they were listed in the new arrival section. So the first is this bed which I think is a gorgeous upholstered bed. I think they've got some nice detailing. The color is really nice. Looks like there's some nice fabric. So I think that that is a pretty great item and it's only $209 Canadian and comes in beige as well as gray. So that is an amazing one. Definitely makes my favorites list for the new arrivals because I think it looks like a really quality product. The next is actually something that I own myself. So this is a pillow cover. It is velvet. It comes in a few different colors. Um, I have it in the olive green color, but I think that the price point's great. And also Ikea sells great inserts for pillows, both down and down alternative. A lot of great spring arrivals in this list so this is a cute little seagrass planter this print set is really really nice i thought that this was a little nicer than your typical ikea prints nice sandy beach and i love this black and white shot here we go here are some of the outdoor items for spring summer so i really loved this bench they also have the same design in just regular chairs it looks really really nice pretty good price point and they do sell cushions to put on top, which is perfect because it's always frustrating to try and find something the right size after the fact. This is one of um, my favorite items for spring. So they have these cute little um, flower box holders, which are great if you live in a condo or if you have uh, railings because it's $15 and you can hang it over any railing and put some nice flowers for spring and summer. And I know that this comes in a few different colors. You can see here at the bottom, comes in a cute little green color, which I like to call cottage green. And it comes in black. And then there's also another one that I love. So I'll show you this one now. So I also thought this was cute, more of like a cottagey um, English garden kind of style, but it's um, a faux wicker flower box. And I really like this little scalloped detail along the top here. So that was the next one on my list. So let's skip by. I thought this one, this uh, next item was really nice. So it's a magazine stand. I've never seen anything like this in stores, but I've always wanted a nice magazine rack. And I think that the price point is again, great. Like Ikea always does. Um, and I think it does fit quite a few styles. So that is definitely a cute little addition that you can grab for your house whenever you head to Ikea next or place an order. Ikea just brought out this new line of kitchen cabinets, which I really, really love. This is actually a really similar color to what I'm thinking of doing for my new kitchen. I think it's um, more of a English country or French country, um, kitchen style, the way that they have the fronts of the cabinets. I really love the warm color. I think that these warmer cabinet colors are very much going to be in trend and people are going to move away from the all white kitchen. So I really love these. I just wanted to quickly mention them because it is another favorite of mine. Obviously it isn't one item. It's many, as you can see, as I'm scrolling through here, but definitely love them and would consider for my own kitchen. So let's move on to just some of my general Ikea favorites. Um, so we're gonna start off with lighting. I've just literally highlighted some of my favorites from Ikea that I would consider putting in my own home. 
So this first one is just a lamp, which would be perfect anywhere in the house. I love that it's light and not very heavy, so it literally works anywhere. Um, and I love the glass bottom. Since a lot of us are working at home right now, I wanted to highlight a lamp that I actually have. It is definitely more um, functional, but I think it is stylish considering it is more of a functional item. So it's perfect to put on your desk to work at and give you a little bit of extra light. I really love it. Um, the one thing I'm not 100% in love with is this detail on the cord. I'm guessing you could probably cover it with something, but other than that, I love this light and I've had it for a few years. So this light is very similar to one that we just installed in a house, um, which wasn't from Ikea, but this one is such a great price point. I love how this pendant looks. It has the nice glass um, dome and then the black cord is also really classy. So this would be great over uh, at Kitchen Island if you had a few of them. And the price point is amazing. This is another one that would also be perfect over uh, Kitchen Island. So I'll just make it a little bigger for you. So it's a little smaller than the other one, but I love the gold detail and the glass shade cover. I think that you would definitely need to get the um, special bulbs for these because it's so visible. So if you put just a regular bulb, it wouldn't look as classy as it does right now. All right, so the last light that I picked Oh, picture lights, because picture lights are so popular right now. I think that this is really, really nice. It would look great over artwork or um, if you are doing built-ins and you saw my built-ins video that I did the other week, this would look great over top of your built-ins. And again, a great price point, $39.99 and it's LED, so it won't suck up all your energy and cost you a lot of money. So that is perfect. Alrighty, so these are just a few little items here and there that I picked. So this is a pot that I really, really liked and I um, considered getting it for myself. Next time I go to Ikea, I definitely will. So $7.99 and it looks like stone and I just think it's nice and simple and looks great. So this one is just a cute little jug that I saw. They are suggesting it as a vase, but I guess you could use it for either. Just a great bookcase accessory as well. Like my bookcase behind, I would totally buy something like this to put on my bookshelves. This is another great vase. I really want one of these. You can see they've got a bunch of different sizes. Um, this one here and then this one over here, but I think it's really nice. It's very like on trend right now. If you got that and put some olive branches in it, you would be set. Really, really nice. So next time, place an order. I think I'm gonna have to get myself one of those. Oh, and here are some faux stems that would look really nice in the vase as well. So these are eucalyptus leaf. I think that these are really nice. See, they've just styled it here with just a vase or they've also mixed it in with some other flowers which looks really nice and not too expensive so a bunch of those would look great here's another faux plant that i thought looked really really nice so i think it's supposed to be like a little eucalyptus yeah it's a eucalyptus plant um looks good quality see they've styled it out on a terrace or a balcony or also inside, so that looks super cute. Love that, just to add a little bit of greenery, especially in the dull winter months, or if you are not good at keeping plants alive. This next one is a faux potted tree, and I think it is so sweet and little. It would also be great at front doors if you had two of them in pots, either side of your front door. They would not die and they aren't that expensive. So if they got wrecked and you had to replace it next year, then that isn't a big deal. So really cute. I love those. I think that'd be great in my, my garden as well. So maybe I will get a few of these for the summer. 
So I'm gonna move on to my favorite kitchen items. These, there's two or maybe even more than two different sizes of these and I just thought they were really nice. I know um, at the beginning of lockdown, everyone was into redoing their pantry. I did it myself. This would be such a nice way to store your different pantry items. You see along here, they've got a few different sizes, which would be definitely ideal. Okay, here is another great pantry item. So I have a few of these and they look really, really nice. So I would definitely buy more next time I go. And sometimes they also look great if you're looking for a cheap vase, if you just take the lid off and just use the base, I think it looks great. This next item is also a jar, great for storage. They do sell lids for it, but I also think it looks like a really cute vase to again, put some um, olive branches or flowers or something in. I just think it looks really cute and it's more of the vintage found look. Another great item, especially if you are into baking, I've been making a lot of pizza lately. So to be able to quickly dust my counter with a little bit of flour and then a bit on top of the dough is great. So one of these is such a useful kitchen item. This item I thought was so functional. I saw this and I was like, yes, this makes sense. So it is a bowl cover, but you can see that the center piece is removable so that you can you put your mixer in there and you don't get the batter spraying up at you. So I was just like, this makes so much sense. And like in this picture, they're serving whipped cream and they just put the top on. So that just made a lot of sense to me. I liked that. And also Ikea has a lot of great baking pans. These are spring form ones. If you try to buy this on Amazon, it is gonna cost you probably $20, $30. So a great place to buy your spring form pans. And if you don't bake a lot and you wonder what is a spring form pan, basically the base and the ring around it are separate. So when you bake a cake, you can easily remove that so that the cake doesn't get stuck. Moving on to dining wear. So Ikea used to have this plate set that I loved and I actually went to buy more of it recently and they no longer carry it. However, they've replaced it with this line, which I still really love. It's a little more simple than what I originally have, but I love the subtle lines on the edges. I just think it's very feminine, almost cottagey, and I just think it's super cute. So I'm hoping that I will replace what I currently have with something like this. And what I love about Ikea is they tend to carry it for a very long time. So if you need a replacement, it's very easy to do. Plus it doesn't come with all the unnecessary mugs. And what they've done this time is they've started including serving ware that you can buy that matches the line, which was my problem previously. So I love when everything matches and the fact that you can buy serving platters and serving bowls to match this is perfect. This is another um, dining set, which I really like. It's not necessarily my style, but I think it is super stylish. If you have a very trendy, um, kind of rustic, maybe even Studio Mickey look, um, this would look really nice in it. I think it looks expensive, even though it's Ikea. Then I just included a few glasses. I thought that these were cute. I love the little rippled edges. I've been looking for some cute glassware, so I really love this because the price point's great and you don't feel so bad if it breaks. This is a decorative item I actually have for myself. It looks really cute over top of a candle. Um, it's just a glass dome, it's purely decorative. Uh, you can see in this picture, actually, they've used it on a serving board to cover up some brownies and some caramel. So that's also a great idea, which I'd never thought of. So finally, um, we're gonna cover living room, dining room, and then office. These are some of my favorite furniture pieces that Ikea carries that I would love in my own home. So I love this sofa. This is my favorite sofa they carry. I think it looks expensive. I think the lines are beautiful. I've seen other people with really beautiful, expensive homes use this sofa and they also have an armchair and they also make sectionals. Um, it's not showing at the bottom here in similar items, but they definitely carry sectionals 
and armchair is in smaller and bigger and just really really nice plus if you did want to get this and in a few years you wanted to up date the cover you could get a cover through them or there's a few different companies um, one that i've used is called comfort works and they make sofa covers specifically for ikea and it makes your ikea furniture look more upscale this is a cute little armchair that they carry this is a really popular style right now um, it's also a pretty classic style and they've got a few different colors, but I think it looks really nice. It is a bigger chair. It's not a tiny little armchair. You could probably fit two small people in this chair very easily. So keep that in mind. This line I'm obsessed with, Lawn Marp. I don't have any of it, but every time I see it, I just think it looks so elegant, especially the dark blue green color. So I really want this cabinet so badly. There's a few other um, items from this line that I like. So I'll show you this one. This is the same, oh, it's not the same. It looks very similar to the other item, um, but it has a glass cabinet on the top. So you put that in your dining room, you could put it in the kitchen. I just think it looks really lovely. And they also sell a bookcase in the same line. So I just think it looks so nice. You can obviously get it in the light beige as well and considering I'm a very light and airy kind of person I kind of love the the moodiness of the dark blue green just for a little variety I included a table that I really liked Ikea doesn't have too many tables that I love but I love extendable tables I just think they're really functional so I think that this is a great um, extendable table option especially if you paired it with some really nice chairs. One more um, table that I love that I came across when I was looking for a friend is this one. It's not so much my style, it's a little trendier, but I think it looks so nice. Um, I also think it fits the Studio McGee um, kind of vibe. So if you are into that, I think it is really, really nice. Just looks so pretty, so. That is another great one if you've not heard of that. It is a little more expensive and it's only a veneer, but still a great option. And then finally, my favorite chairs for dining room. I actually really want these for my dining room. I just haven't uh, made the, the jump yet, but I just think that they're really nice. They look very classy. Maybe not everyone's cup of tea, but I really love them. And I love that they're slip covered because you can easily wash them if they do get stained and replace them if you need to. Okay, so just two items that I have in the office section. So I thought that this office chair was really nice. Um, it looks more expensive, almost like an Eames or something like that, but it's Ikea and if we're we're all working from home right now. I know I don't have a proper desk chair, so this is definitely one that I would consider, and I think it's one of the nicer ones that Ikea carries. And then the last thing I'm just gonna show you, um, there is a desk from that line that carries the bookcases and cabinets that I thought was cute. Um, it's tiny, so if you don't have a big space but you want to have a desk, this is a great option. You can see it has good cable management and a little drawer so i think it's pretty functional with all of us working at home and then if in the future you're not working from home it's still great to just have a little desk that you can tuck off to the side even in a living room and the cable management and drawer make it not as bulky and look messy all the time you can also see someone here has used it as a little makeup desk so i think that is great so that is all that i have got for you. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you made it all the way to the end, I really appreciate it. And if you enjoyed it, I would really appreciate if you gave it a thumbs up so that I know to make more videos like this in the future. I think it'd be fun to do this seasonally because they introduce new products all the time. And since last year, we spent so much more time at home and outside, I think that their spring lineup is going to be amazing and I can't wait to see what else they bring in the future. Thanks guys, bye.